okay uh, welcome back guys so if you haven't subscribed please do subscribe and hit the notification button so i'll be encouraged to drop more content like this in the future okay so from when we left off i've gone back and i made another extra let me see if i can so on this part if you notice this if you notice the eye in here is different from the one here why because i took down on the inner eye i took down the normal map I reduced the intensity for the normal map. So if I should inner eye, inner eye, inner eye, inner, okay. Okay. For the inner eyes, this is normal map. This is normal map in here. So I took this down to 0 0.4. So you can take that down also. Then one other thing I adjusted because I was doing a lot of test renders, kind of figure out which one should figure out which one would work better for this so let me show you guys the changes i made so for this render if you notice the air here and you notice the other air here also the difference is that i added more thickness to the hair in this render same also i added now if you look at the beard there is not that the air, air for the beard is not that thick but for this render added more thickness for the for the hairs and for the beard so let me just show you guys also in here i increase the increase the length of the hair increase the length of the hair so pretty much what i did was that if i should come to this for the beard it was at 0 0.01 before so i set it to 0 0.015 then for the afro head hair it's hidden now, it shouldn't show because it's hidden. For the Afro head air, set this to width to 1.0, so 0 0.015. Then the length, I increased this to, so I think it was at top, so that's one before, I think, but I just increased it to 1.8. So I think that's basically all I did for that. So, but now we need to kind of do something different. I'm going to try a different light setup in here. Like I mentioned before, I want to get something similar to this light setup. So I have a few approach to of doing this. So I'm gonna try the one I let me try the one I just I found some tutorials on kind of see if that work correctly. If not, I'm going to using the other one which I believe that one would work without any issue. So but first I will need to let me close this. So the lights you can see here in here the shadow is around these parts. We have the shadows around these parts. Then we have most of the light source hitting from this region here. So uh pretty much what I will do is to rotate our light a bit more. So but before I do that, I would like to hide this main mesh. Select it, I would Instead of I think let me duplicate it instead. Duplicate it instead. I'll hide this main one. Then for this, I'll just give this a default. It should be a default anode shader in here. I didn't do much on. Uh, there isn't any. So let's just give it a new default anode standard shader. Also, I would like to anything that's do with the hair. I'm going to hide. I don't to hide, hide all of those. I believe the eyebrow. But this. I would hide those. But I just want to see just this mesh instead. Because I'm trying to reduce our render time. Pretty much trying to, trying to reduce our render time. So uh, okay, for this material, I'm going to use a rough material for this. Make it rough. Make it slightly darker. Change our render setting. Why is it so big? So I'm going to be using the use uh let me use low render setting for this for now 
Okay. Do a quick save. So how okay, yes, you need to rotate the rotate the this is dumb letter music. Which okay, this is Tomaco, this is Tomaco Studio. I should probably name this to Tomaco Studio. Tomaco Studio. Can I get a duplicate of this? Let me do a duplicate of this. Hide this main one. Yeah, this is most annoying. Point I do a duplicate doesn't doesn't pick up this pick up the what's it called the AGR that has been applied. It's quite annoying. So let me just delete this totally and just create a new one instead. So AGR skylights. I think it should be on my desktop. Okay, yeah, something like this. So pretty much what I'm going to do is to put this light source, put this light source around here. So I'm just going to rotate this. Let me do this in here. Even at the edge, just to highlight even some part of the hair. Let's see what we have around the hair. Get this. This front facing camera here. Okay, before I save that, let me just let's do a render. Oh, I think I like this angle. I think I see that I save this angle. Yeah, that's the angle. So I will do a quick render. Turn this off. There's a quick render. Let's see. Okay, this is pretty good. I think I will zoom some. Yeah, something like this. Okay. I think this is a good spot. I said what I'm going to do is to... I would... This... Trying to... Wait, maybe we'll take this. Let's, let's see the value. Let's see the value that's actually in there first. Also increase the samples to somewhere around four. Let's see the rotation values. Okay, 140. Let me use this this way a bit more. Let's try 130 in there. Let's try up and render again. Okay. Let's fire up this render again. Okay. Um I think the dark shade should be fine or at the edge should be fine. Alright, that's fine. That's that should work just fine. So I'm gonna do this now. So what I'm going to do is to reduce the 
intensity of the light. Let's go to Arnold. Think on the utilities. There should be light manager in here. So it should be this an AI scale dome light three. So let me put this somewhere around here. Start the IPR. Okay. Um. The yeah, this is intensity. Let me set this zero point three. Okay. I think this should be fine. Yeah, I think I can leave this like this. Okay. I want to rotate the SGR again. Thanks to 100. If it's try 17 instead. Okay. Somewhere around here for now. Yeah, this will be fine for now. So then I would stop the render. So in let me just save this view again. And name this top front. No bottom front rather. Okay. Alright, so uh save this file. So I'm going to be using the light blockers for this. So I'll need to create a an area light first. Create an area light. Scale this out. Lift this up. Kind of tilt this no. Tilt this this way. And view this from this angle like so. Somewhere around here like this. Okay, so then on the light setup, I scroll down to light filters, and I will add a light block, light blocker. You select this. Double click on it to open it up. So it should be somewhere around here. Yes. Somewhere around here. Yes. Let's scale this up some more. Just the size. Okay. Select this, put this back some more. Let's go back to our camera view. Let's see what we have. So let's. Why is this so big? Let's turn. Okay, I'll need to. I need to increase the intensity of this light. Let's kind of normalize for now. Increase the samples to three. Okay. Then increase less um temperature color in there. intensity of the light it's a bit blown out okay I don't know if our light blockers our light blockers not working 
go in there and begin to make exactly working exactly working you can see how increasing the density is making it work convert it to a plane let's just stick with the box okay uh, so I would like to use the picture mapping here. Mapping here. Just for yes, let me create a map for this. Okay, so I'm going to be using this white canvas, and I'm just draw a cylinder. Draw something like this. A uh, rather a rectangle rather so i'm going to give this a color of black okay then the size i would pop out the size completely okay duplicate this hide this Convert this to rasterized layer. Okay. Then I'll duplicate this some more. One, two, three, four. Select the last one. Just drag this down around here. Then I'll distribute this like so. No. Hold and shift extend this out like so. This no. This up no. This I'll push a bit forward. Like this. Maybe like this should be fine. Select all of this, put this in a group, duplicate that group. Restaurant convert to smart objects, then I will blow this out. This is Gaussian blow for this. Click OK. Save this as a texture. Let me just put it in text, my desktop. Uh, let me just name this to light blocker. Okay. So back in here, add a file. Let's stop. Should be this. Open this up. We have something going on in there, but I think you can see something happening in there already. Uh, let me invert. Let me invert this. Invert. <clears throat> Let's have invert this inverted. Okay. Nice thing about this is that I think a uh, light blocker is this will be I guess input to the side. So stop this for now.